why Chamberlain Coffee is so successful where other influencer brands have failed. The main reason is Emma herself. In this Forbes article, she talks about how Chamberlain Coffee feels like an extension of herself. It's pretty clear that Emma is still heavily involved in creative, product development, marketing. Consumers really value this authenticity. They don't want just another influencer celebrity brand that has their name slapped onto it, but it's very clear that they are not involved in the business at all. It's also important to note that starting a coffee brand isn't out of the ordinary or random for Emma. She originally became famous because of her casual lifestyle vlog content, and in almost all those vlogs, she had a coffee in her hand. Emma has always loved coffee and made it a part of her life, her daily routine, and so this brand really does make sense for her. She's also really good at understanding her audience, which is mainly younger, Gen Z. This free brand that Chamberlain Coffee went through exactly targets that young audience. Everything is just super colorful, lighthearted, fun, and most of all, aesthetic. This is super important for a Gen Z audience for products to look good because they're always recording, taking pictures, and sharing their lives online. Chamberlain Coffee also really appeals to the values of their consumers. So Gen Z usually is very eco-conscious. They want things to be sustainable. So that is a big priority in Chamberlain Coffee. They're using sustainable packaging and then also thinking about ethics when they're meeting the best possible standards and labor practices. Influencers or celebrities who have their own brand could definitely take a note or two from Chamberlain Coffee.